Helena, are you carrying any weapons in your socks? <laughs> Why would I do that? Maybe you're putting illegal substance on me. Hello. Hello. Hi, go ahead and have a seat. My name is Janae. What's your name? It's Jamal. I'm Brooklyn. You're Brooklyn. I'm Tony. I really like the suitcase. Thank you. It's so cool. It even has this cool lunchbox. Like, most suitcases don't have this little thing, which I thought was so cool because, like, it's retractable. What's hanging on the bags? What is that? A neck pillow. They look comfy. Because yeah. they are comfy. You know what we're here for today? No. no? We're going to talk about my job. Can you guess by looking at me what my job is? Uh, a baker. A baker? That's a good guess, but no. My job is at the airport. Do you know what that is? It has a lot of and a lot of airplanes. It has a lot, yes. That is a great answer. Just by your outfit, you look like those people who, you know how there's this big rectangle and then you have to take your shoes off? Security. So that's right, I, security. I work for, for airport security, TSA. Do you know what TSA stands for? Transport security, airplanes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's transportation security administration. Have you ever been to the airport? Yes. Yes, so you, you travel a lot? Yes. What's your favorite place that you've been? Everywhere. I like Vegas a lot. You like Vegas? Vegas is fun. I actually traveled last week mm -hmm. to the Lego man. <gasps> I'm jealous. <laughs> so it sounds no. like you guys have a lot of experience flying. Do you know what's okay to bring on the airplane and what's not? Uh, suitcases. So is that, that can go or that can't go? That can. Okay. okay. What are some examples of things that maybe can't go? Like a water bottle but filled with water at, from home. It, listen, you know what you... See, scissors. What, what, scissors? Yeah. yeah. Most importantly, they can't be a certain length. How about a giant bottle of shampoo? Uh, yeah. <gasps> no. Uh. We don't want to bring that through. Why? A lot of the TSA rules are based off of incidents that happened. Bad people tried to use liquids that were over 3.4 ounces to take down an airplane. I'm going to get you guys ready to go through the security line. You all set? OK. All right, let's go. First things first, we're going to get everything in our security tray, OK? Perfect. Perfect. You have anything in your pockets? You're also gonna put those in the bin? I don't have anything. Nothing in your pockets? So you guys familiar with what you do at the start of the security line? Take your shoes. Yeah. Yeah? Why do you take off your shoes? Because there is a gentleman by the name of Richard Reed who hid a bomb inside of his shoes. <gasps> you got all the good snacks in here. So I love this. You love that and I love it too. And that's, hey, that can go through. That's airport friendly. This can go? Mm-hmm. Show me something that can't go. Right? Water. <gasps> Water. So can that go? No. No? You have a couple of options. You can either throw it away or you can chug it. What do you want to do? You want to chug throw the water? Throw it away. I like to guzzle. <laughs> <laughs> All right, go for it. Go for it. Oh, man. You're chugging. I'm impressed here. All right, these are good to go. Let's take these bins and we're gonna set them to the side and then we're gonna put our bags up on the table. I'm sensing a theme here. Is green your favorite color? Yeah. It's an awesome favorite color. So let's go ahead and check these front pockets first. So I see an iPad. Large electronics have to come out of your bag. So we're gonna put that in the bin. You know what that is right here? It's a lock. Special lock, it's a TSA lock. I have one too. Yeah, so do you know what that's for? To lock your suitcase so no one can get in. Uh huh. You're gonna wanna pull out those liquid gels and aerosols that I talked about before, right? Okay. So let's say I had this wonderful jar of Dove. <gasps> Will that get taken away? Well, so based off of what I told you before oh, that's about the size, what do you think? This is how man, 20 ounces. <laughs> I really want the soap. Too bad it can't go. Why, it's too big, right? So that means you're going on your trip without shampoo and conditioner. We can always buy some. There we go, you can. Hey, look at this bag. Ooh, nice. You see what it says on the front? Skin bag? Stink bag? Stink bag. It's a bag for laundry. Yes. Have you seen one of these before? No. This is a metal detector. It's a metal detector. If we find something metal, it's gonna beep. It's... So that means... 
Yes. I'm gonna show you how the handheld metal detector works. So everybody's gonna get in the star position. Can you go like this? All right? And then I'm gonna go down. Helena, are you carrying any weapons in your socks? <laughs> Why would I do that? Maybe you're putting illegal substance on me. <laughs> okay, done, done. All right, and you're all set. Can I check you for metal? You sure can. Get in the star position. I have something metal right there. Sorry, you can't get on your flight, ma'am. What? You know what? You're hired. You're pretty good at your job. Final call, Ethan and Helena. Please head to your flight final call. Yes, ma'am. Sounds like y'all gotta go. I heard the final call. You gotta get your shoes back on and all packed up so you can catch your flight. We're gonna miss your flight. We gotta go. We gotta go. <laughs> Have you ever found something crazy in someone's bag? I found, are you a fan of sharks? No. You don't like the song, baby shark? You don't like that? I love it. See, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not a fan of real sharks. So the craziest thing that I saw in somebody's bag, they brought a baby shark that was in a bottle. What? Sharks can't breathe in suitcases. <laughs> Sharks live in water. <laughs> <laughs>